Good evening, welcome to Wine and Rose TV, joined by head coach Jeremy Cornish. Uh, just the one game on the weekend on Sunday away to Chelmsford. How are you going to approach that game, Jeremy? Well, we'll take it, uh, take it as we do every other single game, so we're going to go in to win it, obviously. So it'll be a big test for us. Uh, Chelmo, we've been close to them two games so far. I think we've lost one and drawn one with them, so uh, those are both here. So going there is going to be a whole different uh, different game, so we'll see how we do. And the uh, report said they've got a few players obviously out missing with injury, and they've been playing well, not as probably as up to par as they have done in recent games. Is, is that anything in your mind, or are you just taking it as they are Chelsea, the league champions, and yeah. double winners? You've got to go there with the right mindset. Yeah, definitely. We never ever look at that. We just got to worry about what we do. There's no way that we can go into Chelsea thinking that you know they may be missing a couple of guys, so it's going to be an easy game because that's definitely not ever going to be the case. And of course, uh, the following weekend away again, just the one game on the weekend at Cardiff. Obviously, never an easy uh, route to get a win in. Obviously, you only won by a few goals the last mm -hmm. visit there. Is that another game you're obviously looking at as a tough fixture? Yeah, they're always tough in Cardiff. They've got a good young team again. Um, you know, they were kind of written off in the summertime and that, you know, they just, they should never be written off because they always work hard and, you know, they, they gave us a good run in here early in the year and they got a tough game down there, so I'm expecting very much the same thing. Yeah, and you're obviously saying they give people a tough run. Obviously, they turned over London in their rink, obviously, just a few weeks ago, so it's obviously a tough match in prospect for that one. Oh, definitely, you know, especially if they're if they're going to, to London to do that, you know, they're, they're known for travelling light, so, you know, they probably took a good team down there and, and gave them a good run for their money, so I'm expecting a pretty hard fight game. And obviously just a few months into the season now, how's your sort of feeling now the campaign's gone so far? Are you quite happy with how things are panning out? Yeah, I think so. I just, uh, you know, I think that we're not playing exactly how I'd like the team to be shaping up. So I think it's just maybe a bit more patience with the guys and maybe some more some more coaching really and get them to play in the exact same way that I kind of want things to take over. We're, we're giving up too many shots. Um, you know, I think I probably need to bring in a player, you know, maybe two if I have to. So we'll see what goes on. But I think the next couple of weeks, this set, Sunday's a cup game, we're going to be in it to win it. But I think the next couple of weeks are going to be a pretty deciding factor. And he's going to be here and he's not. And just on a final thought, obviously being an Ireland myself, it's nice to see some of the Ireland guys doing well. Obviously, in particular, Kieran Anish, Richard Nambard, all stepping up to play, playing pretty well. Is it nice for you as a coach to see the Ireland youngsters coming through the team? Although they're obviously in their 20s now, but, you know, doing well and then get, when they get the opportunity to play and... Yeah, we all knew some good plays. That's yeah. something that's pleasing as a coach. Oh, yeah, definitely. That's the, that's the most rewarding part, especially with Kieran. I've had him now. This is his fifth year, and he's now earning his ice time, and he's now scoring goals and, and playing with confidence. And you know, that's what I need out of him. On uh, Nimby, we you know there was no ice time agreement at all when we started. He, he just came and and he just works his tail off. So you know when I can get him on the ice, he'll play. And then, you know in the games where I need him, he's played full on and just done an unbelievable job. So both those guys are playing with confidence and that's really good for the team. And we're just heading into the weekend, you've got any injury concerns ahead of that match with Chelsea? Or you no, no, I think, I, no, I think we're all good to go. I just, just a matter of getting the guys ready tonight and then we'll see how it goes. Okay, well good luck for the weekend, Jerry. Thanks Cheers, for joining us. Appreciate it.